Hello and welcome to this short demonstration of the CAT rig from the AutoRig Pro Rig Library Blender add-on. This rig is part of a library of 24 animal rigs which can be bought at Blender Market. It's important to note that the AutoRig Pro Rig Library is specifically built for the AutoRig Pro rigging system. So you need to have bought that add-on for the rig library to work. Each of the 24 rigs comes with a locomotion animation and in the case of this CAT rig that's a walk cycle. Uh, let me show you that from multiple angles so you can get a better idea of the walk cycle. And as a side note, I've uh, animated this walk cycle on 30 FPS and not on uh, 24 FPS. Uh, and that's because uh, with the whole creation of this rig and, and, and this animation, I kept game engine compatibility in mind. So uh, yeah, that's uh, why I did that. Cool, let's get back to the features. Of this rig uh, first of all um, this this rig is uh, its main purpose is to act as a template so you can use it to rig your own 3d models so you can use it to rig any type of uh, model with a cat-like anatomy so for example a, a, a tiger a lion a panther or even a, a normal house cat you can all uh, rig those types of animals using this rig so, uh, so that's nice uh, I've included this this block mesh, uh, and uh, that's there as a to act as a visual guide uh, to uh, um, to give you an idea of where to place the bones within your own model. So it's just a helpful tool, but you can easily delete it without uh, uh, um, without any issues. Uh, let me just undo. Um, but it's just there to help you rig your own model. Okay, so onto the controls of the rig. First of all, we have this position controller which is there to position the rig within your scene we have this trajectory controller uh, that's there to animate a certain trajectory for your rig uh, we have this root master controller which well sort of makes sense what that does um, we have this root controller which only controls the lower body, so uh, that's helpful to, to animate a hip sway, for example. We have this tail master controller, which lets you uh, uh, rotate all the tail uh, controls at once. Uh, same thing for the spine master, lets you control all the spine bones at once. Cool, uh, on to the onto the head controller let me turn on tool the tool tab uh, because um, it has this uh, specific property called headlock uh, let me demonstrate what it does uh, when i select the neck controller and i move it around you can see that the orientation of the head uh, follows the neck uh, but when i toggle the headlock and i move the neck again you can see that the head keeps facing forward. So uh, yeah, that's nice. That's what the headlock does. Cool. Um, on to the, the legs. By default, the legs are in uh, in IK, in IK mode, but you can easily uh, uh, switch to FK. And now the leg is in FK. Let me switch back to IK. Um, other properties for the leg are uh, an auto stretch feature. So um, I've turned auto stretch on, and now you can see the leg uh, uh, stretches beyond its limit, uh, which is useful for for any type of cartoony animation, for example. We have tie twist, uh, yeah. So to correct any deformation in the tie, uh, and there's uh, knee pinning so if we have the knee over here uh, if, if I move the leg around you can see the knee follows but if when I pin the knee and I do that again you can see the knee stays in place uh, so that's what that does on to some foot controls here we have a controller for the toes so we can control the toes all at once. We have this foot controller to have a nice bend. 
and here there's a foot roll control when we move it up and down you get a foot roll and when we move it sideways you can have the foot do some banking movement uh, so that's nice um, am I missing anything I don't think so um, yeah th so this is a short overview of the of the cat rig from the other rig pro rig library uh, if you have any more questions about this rig please feel free to contact me on blender market I'm uh, always uh, happy to help um, yeah but thank you for watching